Sir, I'm glad you're here. I have a few questions for you and a few things that I need your input on seeing that Christmas Eve is tonight. Yeah, we really need to kind of get some things settled here. Hmm? Oh, sir, don't you worry about that. I've been doing this for years. I know what I'm doing. Oh, I will get everything all organized for you and get you out the door right on time. With all due respect, sir, have I ever failed you before? No, and I'm not about to start this year. So, let's get some things organized, okay? Alright, so... First of all, let's start with why you came here. I'll just take down some notes. I'm sure you have a few things that you need me to look into for you that you need me to look into and take care of for you before the big day yes yes uh-huh okay i actually have a couple elves already dispatched to go take care of the holes that were in your bag from last year mm -hmm. so that will be ready to go yeah, and I've got a whole team of elves lined up ready for when it's all patched up and fixed to fill it up with all of the toys. Yep, so that is right on track. Don't you worry about that. Also, sir, Mrs. Claus is unpacking your suit and getting it ready to go as we speak. Oh yes, I went and picked it up from the dry cleaners this morning, so all of the ash and soot are off of it from last year. It's good as new. So we've got your suit ready to go, and we've got your bag being repaired. We've got your bag being repaired, and then I've got our team of elves ready to load it, so that is good to go. Yes, that's right, making sure the reindeers are fueled up and fed, feeding the reindeers. I'm going to get somebody on that right away. Do you mind if I just put in a call quickly? Get somebody started on that? Okay. Okay, thank you, sir. One moment. Hi there, this is Pigeon's Elf. I'm just calling to see if anybody has started on fueling up the reindeers for this year's departure. Not yet? Okay, let's have somebody get started on that, okay? Mm-hmm. Yep. You know what? Get Jingles and Trixie. Get Jingles Elf and Trixie Elf to head on out with some bags of food for the reindeers, okay? All right. All right. Okay, thank you. Okay, bye-bye. All right. All right, Nick, that's all taken care of for you, okay? We have Jingles and Trixie on their way out to feed the reindeer. So they'll be all fueled up and ready to go. Yeah. Yes, they actually asked over the phone if I wanted them to, to kind of do a whole inspection of each reindeer just to make sure that they're all in tip-top shape. And I, I said yes. So they're out there feeding and inspecting the reindeers. So that, let's check that off of our list. had the sleigh inspected. Yep, and it's all topped up with Christmas magic. So you will have absolutely no problems with takeoff or landings. Yeah, you have the full night supply ready to go. Yep, so you're good for that. And then you had mentioned last year that your seat was getting a little bit uncomfortable that the cushion was kind of 
flattened out. So I actually went ahead and had your seat reupholstered and had the pillow filled and had the pillow filled so that you have some extra cushion this year so that you're not so sore after the long night. Mm -hmm. Your boots. Yes. Oh, of course. You deserve the best, Nick. You work so hard. All right. And then what else would you like me to look into for you? Mm -hmm. Yes, the reindeer's harnesses have all been checked. The bells have all been replaced. Brand new. Brand new bells. Harnesses perfectly fit. That's done. I had that done on Wednesday. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yep, and I have also had your sleigh fitted with blankets. Yes. Have you decided which elves you want to take with you this year? Yep. Okay, maybe taking three. Yeah, no problem. Okay, so you'll be taking ribbons. Yeah, angel. Ribbons, angel, and snowflake out. Okay. Yes, I see here in the spreadsheet that Ribbons actually has gone for the past two years in a row. Yeah, you, you want to give somebody else a chance? Yeah, no problem. Okay, so I'll switch him with Mistletoe. Mistletoe Elf. Yeah, yeah, they haven't gone for... It's looking like seven years, so they'll be pretty excited to go, I think. So I've got blankets fitted in the sleigh on each of the seats, just in case you guys get a little bit of a chill. And then I decided to pop by St. Nick's Cafe earlier. Yes, I had to. I got a little surprise for you guys waiting in the sleigh. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. So I grabbed you and each of the elves one of our never-ending tumblers, and I filled it with the magic hot chocolate. So you'll have as much hot chocolate to warm you up as you need all night, you and the elves. Of course. Gotta take care of you, right? That's what I'm here for. Okay. And then, yep. Yep, I will have that done. I'll have your boots shined. Okay. And you want the buckle replaced. Yeah, you got it. That can happen. Oh yeah, that'll happen. Okay, I'm just gonna call. I'm just gonna give Mrs. Claus a quick ring and have her send one of the elves out to shine your boots. Hi, Mrs. Claus. Hi, this is Pigeon Self. How are you? Good, I'm not bothering you. Okay, perfect. I'm just here with Nick, and he was asking about his boots. I'm just calling to ask if you mind sending one of the elves out to shine his boots and replace the buckle on his belt. The buckle on his belt. Oh. Oh, perfect. Okay, so the buckle's already been replaced. Yes. You're gonna have Ginger go on out and shine the boots? Perfect. Thank you so much, Mrs. Claus. All right, I'll see you later. Okay, bye. Okay, perfect. So she's having Ginger head out to shine your boots, and she actually already had the buckle replaced, so we can check those off of our list as well. I'm just gonna take note that you're having mistletoe elf, angel elf, and snowflake, correct? A 
accompany you this year. So I will reach out to them after this meeting. Oh, and then the boots will be taken care of and the buckle has already been replaced. Perfect. Oh yes, I've got the tr I've got the trunk of the sleigh loaded up with Pepto Bismol. Um, I know you always need it after all those cookies and all those glasses of milk, so I got you covered for that. No upset stomachs this year. Okay. Yes. Oh my goodness. Yes, we cannot forget the list. Absolutely. How did I forget that? I'm so thankful that you came here to remind me. Okay, so we need the list. One of the most important things. Okay, so I will personally see to it that the list is placed in the glove box of the sleigh, okay? And just so you know, the keys to the sleigh are hung up on the key holder right beside the door to the garage, okay? Yeah. Okay, and then lastly, you know, I'm just going to make a note for myself here. To bring the list to the sleigh. also thought that it would be important to remind you that the Skyway Patrol officers, yes, yes, okay, so you've already heard they changed the speed limit, okay, good, so we actually, it increased from a thousand miles per hour to fifteen hundred miles per hour, yes, so that will allow you to kind of, you know, if you need to take a stop, you can, yes, I have increased the fuel levels of Christmas magic in the sleigh and the reindeers to accommodate the increase in speed this year. Yes. Okay. So I spoke to you about the speed increase. And then you asked me to check the weather. Weather in the skyway. Okay, so the weather doesn't seem too, too bad this year. We're looking at a minus 30 wind chill up there in the skyway, but, but the winds are fairly calm tonight. Yep. And then, and then you're looking at some milder temperatures as you move closer to the equator. But the coldest temperatures that you should be encountering tonight are around minus 30. That's not so bad. That's fairly mild, actually, compared to a lot of years. Good. That's great. Okay. Okay. Has the inventory been done? It is in the process. Yes, I have. Yes, sir. I have a team of 100 of our best elves on that task of taking inventory mm -hmm. of each and every toy. So they've got a list. They're checking it twice. Yes, sir. They're on the second round. So that will be completed by tonight. And then... Mrs. Claus asked me to remind you. I know. She asks me to remind you every year. Just try not to ruin your appetite for dinner. Okay? With all those cookies and milk. I know, sir. I know. She did make a very delicious smelling lasagna this year, though. 
Yeah, she's always talking about how you need real nutrition after such a long, hard night. Okay, and then, so I think that's it for tonight. I think that's all the preparations for tonight. I've spoken to Jack Frost. Yes, I've spoken to him. He will not be interrupting you in any way this year. No, we have the Skyway Patrol on alert for that. Mm-hmm. Okay, and then, so that's all of the preparations that you need for tonight, correct? Yeah, so there's actually just a few things left to do. Yeah, okay, so I'm glad we did this list. I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna go around and just supervise that everybody's doing everything properly. But I did want to let you know that Mrs. Claus, such a wonderful woman, had me book a magical massage for you tomorrow. Your back is always really sore when you come back. Yeah, and your joints and stuff. Oh, I know. I can't imagine sitting in a sleigh and traveling to every house in the world. I do not know how you do it, sir. But you've got a wonderful, magical massage booked for tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Over at the Snowy Balsam Spa. Yes. I know, what a treat. So, Snowy Balsam Spa. That's... At whatever time you wish to show up. You're the only appointment for the day. They cleared their entire schedule for you for the Santa Claus. And they are offering complimentary services on top of the massage. So if you go and you see a package that you think you'd really enjoy after this long, difficult night, you can go ahead and do that. So yes, Mrs. Claus booked a very special day for you tomorrow. All right, sir. Is there anything else that I can do for you? Anything else that I can look into for you for tonight? Okay. All right. Perfect. Well, everything is running very smoothly this year. Everything's going according to plan, and we are on track. Yes. Yes, of course. All right, sir. Yes, I'll see you later, and I am going to go ensure that everything gets completed tonight, okay? All right, big night. Okay, I'll see you in a few hours for takeoff.